Lyro AI chatbot video. Now the key for any kind of long time success in business, let it be e-commerce, SaaS or just dropshipping on Shopify in general, is customer support. And using the new Lyro AI chatbot, which is a new feature which Tidio recently introduced, you can actually automate most of your customer support to actually save you money so you don't have to hire any kind of support agents and also to save you some time. Now, as you can see right here, Tidio actually claims that you can save solve up to 70% of the customer problems with AI and one of these AI features is going to be the Lyro chatbot right here. Now this video is actually made in collaboration with Tidio, however I'm not actually obliged to say anything that I don't actually mean. Now the Lyro chatbot as you can see is the first conversational AI chatbot for small and medium businesses. And basically this AI chatbot is going to get information about your website using the FAQ page or you can also input custom prompts and custom custom information to the chatbot and depending on what you've actually input the AI chatbot is going to print out different kind of support answers. However it is important to understand that Laro isn't actually just going to copy and paste all of the answers from the input that you gave Laro so for example the FAQ section onto the live chat instead they're going to generate in video responses depending on what kind of situation the live chat is in. Now one other thing which is super important to touch on is that Laro is actually only one feature among many great others within Tidio. So Tidio is basically one of the most established customer service tools out there and they offer many great other features like for example live chat, they also offer chatbots and they also offer a lot of other features like help desk, multi-channel, visitors list live preview as well as email campaigns so basically email marketing. However they've recently enrolled a lot of more AI features and within these AI features there is the Lyro chatbot but there are also some other AI features which they've recently introduced which you can check out using the link down below. Now as you can see right here uh, they claim that up to 70% of the common customer questions actually get answered by Lyro and basically you can also boost your user satisfaction using these AI conversations. Now I really like Lyro because you can actually automate most of the customer service within an instant however also not all of the questions can be asked using Lyro. Some of the more advanced questions you will actually have to either answer yourself or you will have to get the support team for that but in general you can really save a lot of time and money using Lyro because I think around 50% of all of the questions will actually get answered by Lyro. Now as for the pricing if you actually want to start supercharge your sales and customer service using Lyro you can get started for completely free using the link down below which is going to give you 50 cost free conversations. Now besides all of the great features, Tedio will actually also allow you to get most of the integrations that you will most likely need. So as you can see, as for the platform's integration, you are going to get Shopify, WordPress, Squarespace, Wix and even some shops that I personally never heard of like WebWeDo, Drupal, shift for shop so basically you're going to get most of the shop builders out there and also WordPress if you want to build up your own custom store. Now as for the app integrations, Tidio will actually also allow you to integrate with quite a lot of apps. As you can see, they have all sorts of different email marketing tools like Clavio, OmniSend, ActiveCampaign, MailerLite, SendingBlue, MailChimp and so on, as well as other apps like for example, they also have the Judge.me app which kind of is a review app, as well as Zapier, Zendesk, Zendesk Cell and so so on. So I think that you will have most of the apps that you will most likely need. However, still if you plan to use any app or any integration within Tilio, then make sure to check beforehand. Now let me now show you how to actually set up your Lyro AI chatbot. Now to get started with, you will actually have to set a data source that the AI chatbot is going to use to generate your responses. Now for me, I've actually just added the FAQ of my website right here, but please notice that you can also set up custom questions. So you don't, you don't only have to use the FAQ of your websites, you can also click on add new question right here. And then we can just type in something like, how long is the shipping time? And then we can say, okay, shipping time is one, to two weeks. So we can also feed the AI chatbot with our own custom information. Now right here on the playground we can actually see how Lyro is going to behave in real time. So as you can see to get started the customer will actually have to enter their email address. So I will just quickly put in mine. It's, and 
And one feature which I really like is the sign up for a newsletter feature. So basically if the customer is going to tick this, they're going to be added onto your email list. So I will just click on send and now Lyro is actually going to give out a response and give out a welcome message to me as a customer. So as you can see, the Lyro actually said, hi there, my name is Lyro, smart and friendly bot created by Tidio, nice to meet you. I'm supposed to answer your questions based on the company's FAQ, feel free to ask any questions. So and if we are now going to ask, how long is the shipping? This is actually going to generate us an answer. Now, and as you can see now, Lyra said, standard shipping usually takes two to eight business days. Express shipping takes one to three business days. And one thing which is important to understand is that this isn't actually just copy paste from our FAQ. As you can see, if we're going to go under the FAQ questions, we can see that this is actually the answer for how the shipping and delivery work. So Lyra has not just copy and pasted this, instead they have generated an answer on their own. And if we're now going to write something like does it cost it is actually going to generate us a new answer and one thing which is important to touch on is that right now we didn't actually reference shipping so Lara actually automatically detects okay we actually talked about shipping beforehand so we're going to talk about shipping now as well and now they've generated us a response which says standard shipping is free for orders for $50 for smaller orders under $50 shipping costs $9.99 so you can basically reference things that you have said earlier in the conversation kind of similar like chat GBT and open AI. And that's basically it for this video. Thank you for watching and if you have any more questions you can always leave them in the comments down below and I will try to get back to you as soon as possible.